Next, we will put in some compositing on the following two days. I bring up my toolbox and I can now select to show more days. I can select to show all these days. So now I'm going to show you how to make a booking over two days. And here we're going to use Emma. So I will now book Emma from 9 to 6 in two days. So I just start at 9 o'clock the one day and then I go all the way to the next day and stop at 6 o'clock. This way Emma will be booked from 9 to 6 each day. And I associate it to our project. Now I need Emma as my VFX artist. There you go. And here we're going to do compositing and we say OK. Now I'm going to show you a different way of adding the next object. So I have the window open. As you see again you have this little icon which means the objects. You re recognize it now, the three cubes and there's a little plus. So I can actually click here and I can then search for the object that I wish to book. And I'm going to use our nuke. And now we will select an activity because the activity in this case has the price that we want. So we will do this compositing our rate. There you go. So now you see they are both in here in this window. So now we have Emma and the nuke. Two days from 9 to 6. And if we again look up here you will see how now we have the grading and now we have the compositing and now we can also again see what we have inside our booking. So the structure is project, booking, objects. And if we just go back briefly to the project again you will see that we have both our bookings in here. And here a total since it's two days it's 18 hours with the buy and the sell and now everything has added up. So we have the total price here and also the subtotal here. And here we have the VAT and the total including VAT.